What's up guys, it's Carhub here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to take the brake actuator out of a 2010 to 2015 Prius. If you own a Prius or want to learn more about Priuses, join the Discord 24-7 Prius chat. The link is in the description. Okay, so first thing you want to do is get a 10 millimeter on the impact and take this brake fluid canister off. Don't forget to unplug this wire right here on the top right. This antifreeze canister is in the way, so we're going to use a 10 millimeter on the impact and take it out as well. You don't have to take it all the way out, and this prevents you from having to refill it when you're done. Now back to the brake fluid canister, we're going to kink the hoses so no brake fluid comes out. Now we're going to take the hoses off with pliers to where it goes into the brake actuator. As you can see here, here's a close-up of where you need to take the hoses off. They're right next to each other and they go into the brake actuator. Now it's time to kink the hose on the bottom of the brake fluid canister. Now that you have done that, you need to take it off as well. Now you need to get a pry tool and take this connector off. Now with a tin wrench, you have to take all the brake lines off that go inside the brake actuator. inside the car and take the four bolts off that hold the actuator to the body this is done with a 12 millimeter on a wobbly and extension with the impact now we have to remove the actuator arm from the brake pedal first just pop off this clip key and after you pop that out the pin just slides right back We seen we had one more bracket with a tin on it, so we had to take that off. Now it's time to just wiggle its way out. And that's how you take the brake actuator out of a Gen 3 Prius. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. If you own a Prius, this channel is perfect for you because we make a bunch of how-tos and Prius reviews.